Hello and welcome to another tutorial on Microsoft Excel VLOOKUP. So in this tutorial we'll uh, see an example where we will try to find uh, the department of an employment based on their employee ID. So let's uh, create the table. So in the first column it will be employee ID. The next column it will be the name of the employee and the third column will be the department of the employee. So let's populate with some um, imaginary data. So the employee will be 500, the name will be John, and the department will be finance. So we have created a table with three rows and heading. So we just format it in a way so it looks nice. And on this cell we have employee ID. So we have created another uh, row so that will be the employee ID and department. So in this cell we will write the employee ID and in this cell the department name will appear from this table. So let's write the VLOOP of function. So we select in this cell and we write equal and then we write the function that is VLOOKUP. The first parameter is the lookup value. So we'll take the value from this employee ID cell and then we press comma. And the next parameter is the table array. So the table is from uh, B2 to D5. And the third parameter is the column index number. So we'll get the department from the first, second, third. So the third column. And the last column will be false. So we have an exact match. So if we press enter, so first of all, it will say that uh, it's not available. So in this cell, if you write 500, it will show the department as finance. If you write 501, it will show you the department as procurement. And if you write 503, it will show the department as the ID. So in this way, you can use this VLOOKUP function to get the value from a corresponding uh, row uh, based on the search of the first column of that table. So thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.